This edition of the Riddler Report is brought to you by... LiveFreeOrDieRally.com August 21st through the 23rd, 2009. It's huge with 20 bands, hundreds of fans, and a reenactment of Revolutionary War stands. Unlike Porkfest and the Liberty Forum, this New Hampshire event is free and it's organized by longtime locals. To attend or donate, visit livefreeordirally.com. Hi guys, this is Lumpy from Keene. Uh, just wanted to let you know the uh, reminder that the city council meeting tonight is at seven. Uh, we're at Richard's house um, in Keene here, uh, putting some signs together. We do have chalk, so if people want to come, we're going to try and get there early. And if you have any great slogans, anything you want to put down on the sidewalk, um, we'd love to have you come. It looks like we're going to we're, we're uh, Andrew's out trying to see if he can get some folks from the uh, Keene State College to come over. Um, and uh, we can't let these people steal these people's homes. Uh, we can do our best to let them know. So um, anyways, please come join us. Bring signs. Bring yourselves. Bring your person. Bring whatever you can. Thanks. Hey, the latest news from Sam I am at ObscuredTruth.com is that he's checked in on the houses. Uh, one of them is empty. The lady died, and nobody knows of any relatives. Odds are good that'll get tax sold uh, or tax de deeded tonight. But the other three do have people living in them. Two of those three have paid the gang here at the last minute. So uh, the the third guy, Sam, was unable to get a hold of. So it's unknown. Uh, what is going to happen there. Okay, just wanted to give you that update. Uh, more at freekeen.com as it develops. This is Dale. We got out of city council meeting a little while ago. They voted unanimously to serve eviction notices to people who um, to people who, who had not paid their taxes. So they unanimously voted to steal some homes and kick some people out of their house, out of their homes. Uh, at the same time, they voted to uh, spend $5,000 to help pay for a study on whether a food co-op would be viable in Keene. And uh, food co-op people were celebrating their victory of stealing money for their food co-op while some other people were going to be kicked out of their homes because of not paying their taxes. And um, anyway, the, there's about five of us now at Pedraza's, the uh, offensively painted orange, yellowish, uh, restaurant, so uh, if anyone, right next to Vendetta, and it's a great place. I love it here. We've had food here. It was really good. And if anyone wants to join us, we're just grabbing a few nibbles here. And um, <laughs> be, uh, feel free to come by. This edition of the Riddler Report is brought to you by LiveFreeOrDieRally.com.